here is all about experimenting to find the key to happiness. And when I say experimenting, you're about to see exactly what I'm talking about. This morning, we are in Big Sur, a region full of national parks, and this foggy weather is perfect for what I'm about to experience. Hello? Hello. My name is Antoine. Antoine, John. John, okay. Yes. So I heard that here in Big Sur, um, you do like a um, really special wake up. Yes, the, but the Post Ranch offers this unique opportunity to work with the shamanic practices. The shamans see everything as alive. There's no separation of spirit and matter. How can shamanism can bring you happiness and can turn you uh, happy? Absolutely. So shamans see life on four layers. Okay. And each one creates the next. So before <coughs> we do work on this level, I'll be opening sacred space. I'm going to call on all the forces of nature that I've connected with in my training, a very extensive training as a shaman. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start just by doing a little bit of uh, smudging, a little clearing just generally of the day, of the energy of the day, mm -hmm. of the morning. Palo Santo. Shamanism is an animist religion in which deities embody various aspects of nature. To meet them, you must accept to leave your body and let your spirit wander. According to them, that's the way to reach spiritual happiness. I'd like you to choose a stone to work with. This is my mesa. In the Karo tradition, it means altar. I just want you to choose whichever of these are attracting you right now. So hold on to this one, please. Think about the negative. I want you to blow that into the stone <sighs> three times. Great. Okay. I'll take the stone. Now it's been informed by the possible negative energies. Now it's going to pull those energies. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Yeah. Okay, but I'm going to open sacred space now. I'm going to call on all of my team to come help us do this work. Curious as I am, I let John's shamanic chanting soothe me on my way to inner fulfillment. This land hold us in the ancient wisdom and the wisdom of the Really hard to explain, but yeah. uh, Good. it's my first feeling. No Much freer to be in that flow, to be fully present. What did you notice? Um, your face was on the same. Right. Yeah. Changed a little. Yeah, the color. Mm -hmm. And maybe, and I don't know, maybe it was this, but um, some. It, Kind of a birdie, birdie, um, or yeah. falcon face, or something yeah, like this. Yeah. yeah. If, you're, if you're worried about something, things aren't going well, you can blow it into an object or a stick and give it back to the earth, or burn it, or bury it. Something very simple like will allow you to stay very free. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Okay. It's a pleasure. 
C'est pas forcément. So, shamanism isn't for everyone because it digs deep within your soul, and it's up to you to decide if you're ready to go through this unique experience. À tenter cette expérience unique.